We're here with Maria Bernardes. This is her old book. You'll probably all recognize this award-winning book. And now we've got a new book. Maria, hello. Hi, Peter. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Yes, and uh, my new book is uh, called Cooking and Eating Wisdom for Better Health. Now, what's the philosophy behind this book? Well, it's an interesting philosophy and really quite different to my first book in that it resurrects all the ancient wisdoms and philosophies from ancient Greece. Like whom? Well, we've got Hippocrates, uh, we've got Theophrastus, Dioscorides, and it's all the wisdoms and philosophies on healing, spiritually connecting back to yourself, and basically cooking and eating. You sound like that you'd be organic, you'd be an organic girl. The reason why I eat certified organic, it's not just because it's good for our health, because it doesn't have the chemicals, but also they have been grown in a certain way that respects the animal and the fruit and vegetable. The ancient Greeks believed that if something was treated in a painful way, that pain also entered your we body. Take that on. You take it on. You take we don't the want energy. Any more pain. <laughs> no, we want love. We, we want love. <laughs> yeah. oh. And this is what the book's all about. About Cooking love. Love. Agape, but not just love, unconditional love. Um, you know, everybody speaks about, you know, having love in, uh, you know, other areas of their life, but we forget about the kitchen and we forget about the ritual of eating and of course introduce ingredients which is very important mm. and then I, I cover what would each ingredient use for example uh, you know carrots for example we're called love charms so I talk about the mythological aspect of carrots. So what is the inspiration behind writing this particular book Mary? I'm trying to help people as they turn each page that it helps heal them and they awaken to their new potential. It's trusting in themselves. And finding your own self-worth too. And we know that when we wake up in the morning, it's like, what should I have for breakfast? You know, what does your body want? It will tell you. We just need to listen to it and go with it and not be so judgmental, which is another chapter. Bit of controversy in there, but no, I'm no, passionate I'm about it. I'm reading it as well. Yeah, and so, so will you. So go out yeah, there and buy this wonderful book, Maria Bernard.